Hello, my name is Jupiter Hadley, and today we're doing another version of Jupiter Plays All the Games, this time with the DreamHack Summer Jam Magic vs. Science. This is a game jam that allows five of the winners to showcase at Sweden DreamHack, so that's pretty exciting. I'm guessing the theme was Magic vs. Science. I'm playing all of the games that are in this jam for a minute each. Links to the individual games, about 10 per video, will be in the description, so you can check them out further. At the end, I'll probably have an article of my favorites on BigBossBattle.com. If you like what I do or any of the content I create, consider supporting me on Patreon or following me on various social media platforms. That, along with the links to these games, will all be in the description. Alright, next. We're playing Guardian of the Realm. Intro, welcome Guardian. The next few lessons you will be taught how to build a spell and shoot it with your staff. Let's get to it. Alright, building. At the start of each round, you will have a bit of time to build traps to help defend your foes. Simply press number of keys on your keyboard. Fighting, make sure staff are holding right mouse button and clicking. Cool stats. The Guardian of Three made stats, health, mana, and build points. Health, you find. Your help keeps you from being dead. Mana, shoot your enemies. Cool. Your goal is to keep the realm safe. Alright, I think I think we'll be fine. I've, oh, I've played games before. Alright, so there's a couple different levels here. Let's start with the easiest one. Well, these are very certain chat. I feel like this wall we should also select. Oh, there's four slots. We can select one of each one. Cool. Alright. Let's set forces them to walk on this one or this one. This is also thinner here. I'm also clicking towards them. Attack. Eliminate. Are oh, they gonna try to break my wall? I figured they'd just go on that. What does it say? Move, I don't wanna remove. Oh, that's not good. Ah, uh, I don't feel like I'm actually doing any damage when I use my staff, though. And I'm dead. Hmm, I very much like the graphics and this, like, way of doing tower defense, but I don't feel like my attacks actually do anything. Next. We're playing DOC, Duel of the Century. Um, this is a two-player game. There's only one of me, so meh. Um, I have all of the controls open on the other side. We have to, like, create a combination and then shoot. And that person can actually dodge with IOP. Oh, wait, no, it's not with enter. And how do you shoot backspace? These controls are a bit weird. And you can dodge with space. This is so slow moving. I, I dodged too soon, okay. This is a neat idea. How do we dodge you? Oh, I still didn't dodge in time. That one's so fast moving. I like how you create spells. So you can just start like really hammering the other player with spells as well. Hmm. Next. We're playing the science of magic clicks. <laughs> Oh, it's like a clicker game, but I could pick a side. I decided to pick them. Let's see this. Little production. Okay. Okay, they're just gonna do their thing and give us more. Going down the copper route. Alright. I don't really know what these things do, but that's nice. I quite like clickers with cute graphics. I like the background to this as well. I'm waiting for something along the bottom to light up. Not gonna do it. 
Can you go back to the menu? No, alright. I was just trying to see if I could switch to the other one real quick. <laughs> Double for click value again. Next. We're playing Wizards vs. Science. I think I need to reload the game. They all have short sorry. move towards me. Just saying. Or they just move towards the center. Yeah, yeah. It's a very simple little game. Yeah. Well, you need to die though. <laughs> My bad. <laughs> Next. We're playing Mac versus Slime. Let's choose Slime. What? Okay. This looks kind of like a tower defense game. I'm unsure if it's a tower defense game. Hmm. It says defend the tower or attack the enemy. That looks like the enemy. So is this slime thing ours? Oh, here's some slimes. Okay. All right, so we have like fired out some slimes. Maybe like eight slimes. I like the giant green defense slime. So I'm sure they'll meet in the middle somewhere. more attacking slimes. They're awfully slow, I kind of wish we could fast forward them. A couple people here. Got our slimes inching forward. Do you like the tails on the slimes that are kind of like worms? They're just kind of waiting there though. Maybe that's what defense slimes do. Maybe they kind of pick a spot and they wait. I would check on ours, but action's gonna happen, so. Two tax lines. So two tax lines is really fast. I wish someone went up there. Six tax lines. These slimes are getting ready to attack. I just kind of didn't do anything. One of them died. So just kind of slime through. Hmm. I wish there was some sort of animation that showed that one was getting hurt. Ah, oh, they destroyed one though. Good. Next. We're playing Robo Magi. All right. So it's mainly Number Pad that does this. Um, I have the. I just won your game. I have to use Number Pad. Cool. X to select. So I'm just trying to understand these controls a bit. Four. Six, five, two. Cool. I guess we start. I don't know how to jump, so. So I'm gonna walk forward. Oh, those are spikes. I feel like there must be a way to jump when we look. Oh, there's a bunch of these. Z. Sorry, I was looking at the menu controls and not the in-game controls. Z. Ooh. C for magic spell. V to switch spells. A to interact. There's just so many, so many random buttons. Okay. But how do we... How do we move up? Oh, okay. There we go. Now that we know the actual keys. So many keys though. 
It does say aid interact and A is totally jump. It says oh wait, wait that was hitting Z. Can you move through this door? Yeah, alright. That's what I was trying to do, just interact with that door and I was just pushing the wrong button. Oh, as I said, we're doing so much better now that we know the controls properly, and then we got hit. It's a very nice platformer. That's what C does, okay. I wasn't sure if it was asking me to press C there. Playing science versus magic. Uh, big game name, big old game, and big old name. <laughs> this looks like more tower defense type thing. It's still an energy we had. Alright, we did good. Keep going forward. Oh, they don't move until there's an enemy to attack. Interesting. Oh, so there's drones to go by. I think all my people died. They're also not moving forward. The music's quite nice. They're still trying to get all the way over to their castle. They killed my big guy. Next. I'm playing Viral Gnome? No more? That sounds really nice. I don't know what I'm meant to be doing. Hmm. Yeah, just double checking the instructions don't say anything. So maybe this is the game, it's just these sounds. They're nice sounds. Yeah, I guess that's it. Definitely interesting. Well, next. We're playing magic versus science. I feel like this is a two player game. Well, the other player is supposed to be doing maths. But I don't know the answer to that maths. Here, wait, while I pull up a calculator. I don't even know how to type in a wall. 36 minus star plus. What? I don't even know how to do that actually. Hold on. So I guess we'll just keep typing. Yeah, I Q. Uh, <laughs> I just have to wait until it fills up so that I can then be done with it. Okay. So when you mess up, that's really not good. Q and U. It just kind of makes it a smaller wizard or a less dumb wizard. So what if you mess up here? can't do big numbers. Oh, I just want to like backspace that because I can probably do that. Okay. Okay, this is a math problem that we can do with a calculator. I just want to see what it spawns. Two, six, eight. I can't do mental math. Four, twenty, eight. Two, two, five, five. Oops. That's what it said though. What? I don't know. Math. Next. We're playing Algomancer? Sure. A, okay. A, D, space to jump. S to show. Okay. Main spell, old spell. Cool. 
I like how we have money. It's just a dollar sign. We're looking for some money. Is the sun an enemy? Can't make that jump that easily. I don't like a double jump though. Hey look, some money. There we go. There's a chest over there. It's a little dungeon crawler. That bat flew through the wall. Good few bat. Oh, let's get to this chest. We found an ancient scroll, so it's speed. Yeah, that was a big jump. Ah, oh, sometimes I look at these walls and I think that they are going to be. Let's flip the switch. They're going to be. Oh. I can't actually go backwards there. These like walls that I just passed through, I keep thinking they're walls, but they're like scaffolding, I guess. It's a good start. It just needs a little bit more polish. Next.